morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Art with Mrs. Buffo. Today, we're gonna be discussing cave paintings, and we're gonna take some time learning about an art concept called profile. That's when you're not looking at the subject head on, you're looking at it from the side. This is a profile. I'm excited to get this lesson started. Let's do it. Today, we're focusing on the Lescaux cave paintings. This is an area in France where large limestone settlements of rock are honeycombed with different caves. The people of the prehistoric era were able to create art in these caves. Lescaux is famous for its Paleolithic cave paintings found in a complex set of caves in the Dordogne region of southwestern France. Because of their exceptional quality, size, sophistication, and antiquity, these cave paintings are important for art everywhere. These paintings are estimated to be up to 20,000 years old. The paintings consist primarily of large animals, which were once native to the region. Today, we're working with big sheets of brown construction paper. As always, we're putting our name, date, and class on the back. These sheets are 18 inches by 12 inches. Let's start this project by aging the paper. We're gonna tear up the corners and the sides. This is gonna give us a nice texture that almost looks like hide. The next step is crumpling that paper up, giving it some more texture. Now I want you to go through your crayons and find some neutral colors. Let's remember what neutral colors are. Art, neutral colors, are defined as colors not found on the color wheel, but found in nature, including on our bodies. Types of these colors include white, black, gray, brown, tan, sienna, burnt umber, caramel, and sand. There are more neutral colors not listed here. If you seem to be having trouble identifying neutral colors in your crayons, maybe because the paper wrapping is off, flip your paper over and do a color test on the back. Do you remember the special way that the animals were facing in those cave painting examples? They were all in profile. Let's review what profile means. In art, Profile can be defined as an artistic point of view. It means the side view or something which can be observed partially or from the side. Profile need not give the full information of a person, but helps in analyzing a part of it. Likewise, knowing an outline of art from one side defines the term profile. The next step in our artwork is to create animals from the profile. So remember, we're gonna see the side of the animals. I've included a horse here and kind of a prehistoric looking buffalo. These were all inspired by the pieces that I looked at earlier. I'm also including the form of a human hunting with a bow and arrow. Something that I've seen in previous cave paintings are lots of handprints, so I'm adding that too. In this next step, I'm gonna add a little more crayon rubbing to the outside of my paper to give it an aged appearance. This has been Art with Mrs. Buffo. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you soon.